In this video, what I'm gonna be walking you through is how you can use Apollo to scrape leads for your marketing agency, but I can almost guarantee that you've never heard of anyone scraping leads this way. The typical tools that people use is something like Apollo Lead Scraper, which is a Google Chrome extension that costs something like 5,000 US dollars, or you can just buy add-on credits. So when you buy a $99 Apollo plan, you can export 1,000 leads a month, but if you know anything about doing cold email, you probably burn through 1,000 leads within a week and you need a lot more than that. And if you wanna add on to that, it ends up costing anywhere from like 200 to 500 US dollars a month just to export some extra leads. So instead of paying an arm and leg for those tools, I've got a free tool that you can use that is faster, better, and cheaper at the same time. Now, if you don't already know who I am, my name's Shade Ethereum, and I'm the founder of acquisitiongrowthpartner.com, and we partner with established marketing agencies to help them add an additional 50 to 100K a month within five to 10 months without having to spend a cent on ads or deal with nightmare low paying clients. So if you're interested in finding out how you can scrape leads with Apollo, let's jump into it. Now, before I get into the tool, what I wanna walk you through is the old way of doing things. So how you used to do things is that you'd buy one of these plans and then you only get a thousand export credits per month. Now, if you're sending the right amount of volume that you need to be sending, you probably end up buying some add-ons. Now, look, let's look at how much the add-ons cost. So if you want to get an export an extra 1,000 leads, 50 bucks, but usually you're probably exporting an extra 5,000, which costs another 250 USD. And then if you're doing even more, 10,000, 25,000, you can see how this starts to add up, and this would be a monthly cost. Now, the alternative tool that other people use, this is a once-off cost, so this isn't a subscription, but this is called Scrape Apollo. And nothing against this guy, I'm sure it's a great tool, but not everyone's gonna wanna spend $5,000 on a tool like this. And I'm pretty sure the tool I'm about to show you does exactly what this tool does, but does it for free, which is always a plus. So what you wanna do is open up Apollo.io. You wanna come here. Actually, before I get into that, just something I wanna say. You need this plan. You need at least a $49 plan, so it's not entirely free. And that's because you need the email credits. So you need the unlimited email credits. So this isn't actually unlimited though. It'll give you 10,000 and 10,000 is more than enough. And for only $49 for you, you to be able to scrape 10,000 leads, that's a really, really good deal. But if you only get the free one, you can only scrape 100. And then it's real. if you buy these ones, there's no really added benefit because you don't need to use the export credits. You're gonna be using the tool. So going back to this is you wanna get your list ready. I've already gotten my list ready. So I've got my saved list. But what I'd typically do is, this is how my list would look. It would look a little something like this. So I like to filter by employee count, keywords, and I find the keywords. I find the ones that I do want by looking at the keywords here. And then I also look at the ones that I don't want. So in this specific one, I'm trying to find e-commerce agencies because that's where we have really good results. And then you wanna exclude like PR, content, blog, things of this nature. And I like to, when I'm looking for marketing agencies, I like to target specifically by industry. And you can also do this, say for example, you're targeting furniture brands, well maybe your industry would be either furniture or retail. So then that way you're not getting random industries in there and you're, you're not picking up random industries just from the keywords that you put in. And then I also like to select verified and then some of the technology. So technologies for our marketing agencies, things like WordPress for their website, Webflow for the website, ClickFunnels, like some funnels, Stripe, and then also tools that they'll be using to help their clients get results like Klaviyo, MailChimp, and ActiveCampaign, and Google Analytics. And that's pretty much the process that I go through. And then also, you know, founder, CEO, owner, but then some people might like to add in chief marketing officer, director of marketing, things like that. Once you have your list, what I like to do is you select all the people and then you wanna save that as a list. I'm not gonna do it because I already have my list ready here. But the reason why you wanna save it as a list is because then it'll find all these emails here. Because if you try to use the tool without first finding these emails, you're not gonna get the results that you want. Like you're gonna scrape a bunch of leads, you're gonna get every part of information that you need except for the emails. Which if, you, you, like, if you're watching this video, you're probably wanting to run some cold email campaigns to some of your leads. Now these emails aren't always gonna be correct, so you wanna filter it down even further and use a tool, but I'll jump into that in a sec. So Instant Data Scrape is the name of the tool. If you don't already have it downloaded, go ahead and download it now. And then as you can see, look, 2,639 five-star ratings. The tool must be good if it has that much because on Chrome Web Store, people are usually savage with the reviews they leave. And the fact that it has five stars from 2,600 people, well, that's saying something. So go ahead and download that tool now. Now, what you should have here 
is you should be looking at you know all your leads that you've just saved and they should have their emails exposed. So then you should have the tool up here, click on it. Now your tool is gonna look a bit different. It won't say start crawling, it'll say click on something. And what you'll need to click is you need to click on it so that it's highlighted green like this, as you can see there. And then it, the next thing it'll say is should say start crawling. And then start crawling means it'll start going through the pages and start scraping these leads for you. So we'll do that. And just watch how fast it does this, by the way. It's already scraped through 75 rows. And at the moment, how many are we scraping? 487 prospects. Nice. I'm gonna pause it until it's done. As you can see, it's just about to finish up here. And so far it's just taken just over a minute to scrape. I think we're done, 437. Okay, we're all done. So then what you'll do is you can either, you can change the name of these columns because the name of your columns will have like these random codes here. So you wanna name them correctly and then download a CSV. Okay, that's all downloaded. And you obviously have the tool, but I don't have the correct stuff on my thing. So I need to upload this to drive. Replace existing files. Upload it. And then look, you have all these leads here. What I like to do from here is that I'll open up in a Google Sheet wait for that to open and then you're gonna have all this information here so I like to delete all the stuff that I don't actually like so that I don't need so that'll be like these keywords and then other socials you don't really need Twitter you might need I like to keep these ones you don't really need the industry the company headcount the city, I don't like to keep the city. Uh, website, you probably need company name, you probably want all that. This you don't need and that you don't need. So then you'll have first name. Then you have all these rows. This is pretty much all you need. And then because you're gonna be doing outreach out, uh, through email, you need to have a first name column because they only give you a full name for some reason. So then I like to use this extension or add on called split names. And then you pretty much select all of this. Keep scrolling down. And then go tools, extensions, split name, start. Mm -hmm. Split. Then you come through here. Now you just want to double check, make sure the names are in the right spot. Cause some of the, you, some of these might be blank. And then I like to use another tool on top of this because sometimes when you come, where's the company name? Company name will be like highlighted like this. So to get rid of that stuff, I use a tool called Lead Formatter, which that's a paid tool, but you don't need to use it. You can always just do it manually. So first names would be B. Columns with email is H. So this is just get rid of columns that are blank and just clean up your lead sheet for you really fast. Uh, company name would be E. Bit blind there, guys. Don't have my glasses on. Uh, job title, not really filtering by job title, so you can just leave that blank. And then working, you can see it'll clean up your list for you and then split through the ones that have LinkedIn only. So then what you have here is your lead list, okay? And then what you wanna do is download, download a CSV, because now you've got your good data right, guys, but now you've gotta verify this even further. I like to use bulk email checker. A lot of you probably heard of this tool. And the reason for that is because one, it's really good, but you, it's really cheap too. Like you can get like 
10,000 email validations for $10. Whereas with other tools, you get like 5,000 email validations and they charge you like 100 bucks. So this tool is a clear winner when it comes to that. So you want to come here, bulk verify. And uh, choose your file. So I just download that one. Yep. Upload. And then that's that. So that's pretty much the process of how I go about finding leads, scraping them, and then reaching out to them. So all you need to do if you want to use this, you need to download the tool Instant Data Scraper. Then you need to use Bulk Email Verifier, so this one, but the Bulk Email Checker. And then also as well, if you want to make your job easier, you can use Lead Formatter as a tool and split names just to make your job easier. But those things can be done manually if you have the time. I just prefer to be efficient with that stuff. So. That's how you scrape it. If you enjoyed this video, I recommend that you go below, leave a comment, let us know what your thoughts were. And if you run an established marketing agency and you have at least three good case studies, you have some happy clients and you're doing around $20,000 per month and maybe you wanna add an additional 50 to 100K per month, consider clicking the link in the description, which is the first link at the top. Now you don't have to, the main thing is that you just watch these videos and you do get some value. But if you wanna add additional 50 to 100K a month, click the link. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later.